you guys welcome welcome we have a absolute treat for you tonight one of my dear dear friends is going to explain everything about liquid collagen and activation so uh, i want to introduce you to dr sveta silverman out of edmonton alberta uh, she again like i said is a dear friend we love traveling the world with her and doing life with her she's one of the smartest people i know on activating the body. She has spoken across the globe, you guys, at different symposiums and presented different posters uh, around uh, activating the body. So we thought it would be amazing and incredible to have her educate us on why this is different, why collagen is so important. Um, and she, uh, in her day job, is a surgical pathologist. Um, and when she immigrated to Canada from Russia, she actually went back to medical school a second time in Russia. She was a pediatric surgeon. So she's been to medical school twice. Uh, again, she's one of the leading uh, people of knowledge around the world in activating the body. So without further ado, I want to turn it over to our good friend, Dr. Sveta Silverman. Thank you very much, my good friend, my mentor. Thank you, Pose. You are the love of the team, you're the support, you're the leadership, you are the, that anchor and the captains. Yeah. So anyway, thank you guys, love you. So let me make a disclaimer. Am I a specialist in collagen? Not exactly. Do I look at the collagen every day in my practice? Absolutely, that's a whole thing. As a surgical pathologist, I looked at those things those lines kind of not uh, asking myself why so obviously when life vantage or anybody comes with something new new product or some concept i educate myself i dig into the uh literature search so um you know liquid collagen we're going to talk about this liquid collagen and why this is so important. As you know, collagen is it. There are plenty, plenty of compositions of collagen and we get, I get bombarded, which one, which one is good. And this is very important. A collagen is different from collagen. So now as a pathologist, I look at the cells and this is what excites me now. We know that the collagen is the most plentiful protein produced in the body. Now in this slide, I just put per se, the fibers, the connective tissue. However, however, collagen is in every cell and in every organ. And I will explain why, and that will determine the significance. Now, being in life vantage, what are we all aware of? We are all aware of, of the concept of oxidative stress or free radical damage. Again, a major cause of aging related skin damage thought to be due to increase of levels of free radicals and oxidative stress, which is uncontrolled abundance of free radicals. That's one number one. Now, when I told you about me as a pathologist and a collagen in every cell, this is a picture of completely two different organs. But to give you the importance, so let's say this on the left hand side is the skin. On the right hand side is the cross section of the blood vessel. But the similarity here, you see collagen here, collagen here. Let's say we're just going to go into a little bit elastic fibers here and elastic fibers there. So what is this collagen? Now, the thing is about collagen is we make collagen. There are cells, I'm not going to name them, they are right here. These cells, sorry, they're called fibroblasts or fiber something, fiber, making fiber. So they make collagen but something has to feed them to make collagen. Well, guess what? 
collagen peptides, feed them. And I will explain to you what collagen peptides are. Now, so this we're calling collagen is a cellular framework. You know, when Poe's were building their house, uh, Sean was posting the uh, updates and that's where you see the framework. So it's like those things were started to build. There was like the foundation, the framework of four something pillars. And then there was something across and there was something diagonal. This is the framework. What is the framework? Now, in this case, for example, the importance of framework of collagen is, so, okay, you don't have the framework of collagen and other collagen type fibers like elastin. Your blood vessel is going to collapse. Your blood vessel is going to collapse. What's going to happen? You ain't going to get blood into the organ of distribution, right? So that's in the skin, it's easier sort of in the, in the blood, the, the blood vessels, it's hard for us kind of to imagine this. In the skin, it's easy. You just look at your aging skin. Now, framework, production of collagen and other components of something in the cells that all the organelles are floating, which is called extracellular matrix high when there is a sufficient level of mechanical tension on those cells that are actually make collagen. So those collagen fibers, that framework has to be dense. It has to be young because when those fibers, let's go to the next slide, start, see how dense they are right here. When this thing started to shrivel and shrink and collapse, guess what's happening? Aging is happening. The wrinkles are happening. And that framework is very complicated because look, there are plenty of collagen. This is the section of skin. It's just in this direction, not in this direction. So this is what supports our the skin, the vitality, the structure of the skin. And there are multiple fibers. There are multiple parts to the framework, but it's all, all of this is built on what feeds those fibroblasts or the cells that make these fibers. And what feeds that is actually collagen. So that's why it is so important. So now, when we go into this, so now we are going to get, so I gave you a little bit of a science. Hopefully, Michelle, please give me something that it was understandable. So, you know, it may, because this is the importance of this collagenous framework of the elastin fibers framework. So this, like, this is like this, not like this. And that what is going to bring the youth back. When you think of the skin, it's just one organ. You have to think of that framework in every organ in every cells. That's your youth and vitality. Now, liquid collagen. Now, our, the, I started with the quality. What separates our, now, there is dry collagen and there is liquid collagen. Why? So our collagen and it's not exactly like collagen, it's a broken down collagen into what is called collagen peptides. Why do we do that? First of all, the origin, it's a fish derived from fish skin. And as you see here, for example, what I'm giving you, I'm giving you the types of collagen, which is extremely important because this not only covers the skin, the liquid collagen, you know, we obviously promote it as the skin product, but it is a whole lot more. Why? So let me get into my cheat sheet. So let's say collagen type five, it's in the blood vessels. Collagen type eight is in the cornea. Collagen type 10 is in the cartilage. Um, uh, collagen type 11, 
in all tissues. So it gives you an idea and collagen is in your brain cells. So this, that's to give you the idea, the importance of it. Now, collagen, it's a big protein. That's why, for example, the weight 2000 units or 2000 Daltons, it's very hard to digest it. It's very hard to absorb it. That's why the uniqueness of liquid collagen is that it is broken down into fragments, which are called peptides. And the peptides have a molecular weight that is much lower. It is somewhere between three to like a hundred units, three to hundred Daltons. So that what is bioavailable and bioabsorbable again, only in relations to the source and the fish sources in my mind is probably the best. From the peptides, which is the composition of few of these, which are called amino acids. And different amino acids represent different collagens that we have here. And that, what applies not only, that's what I've learned, it applies not only to the framework, but it applies to the basically nutrition, to the feeding of the cells. We already accentuated that the feeds those fibroblasts, something that produce collagen. It's like we eat collagen to make more collagen in the cells. But if it feeds fibroblasts, it also feeds some other cells. And there are studies on collagen peptides feeding our brain cells. Yeah, I know. Now, we're going from one ingredient to the other, and then I will summarize it. Collagen benefits. It's a different, techno unique technology. Whatever hydrolysis, I'm not going to talk small molecule peptides, we discussed that. High quality with excellent bioavailability, we discussed that. It improves skin collagen density and promotes skin moisture. We're, skin density is very understood because the framework is now dense and tense. Now, next, the second major ingredient is green acerola extra. Okay, if you're in life vantage, it's a strong antioxidant and cell anti-aging. It contains abundant antioxidant uh, ingre in, um, ingredients or whatever parts, components. Now, it's interesting, look at this. Acherola is rich in vitamin C, which is extremely synergistic for collagen strengthening and growth. It protects cells from free radical harm. It promotes collagen and elastin growth. Improves skin texture, moisture, and firmness. Do you see the kind of the theme? Now, the third hero is red quinoa extract. Interesting thing about quinoa extract that it upregulates something that we kind of familiar in Life Vantage, which is called NRF2. NHO, which is, stands for hemoxygenase. Awesome. But then what it does, it enhances the ability of collagen secretion of the skin. We mentioned fibroblasts, prevents the degradation of collagen and resists the damage of ultraviolet light exposure. Now, what are the, so now let's go through the ingredients and the synergy and the common theme. We discuss fish, fish collagen peptides. Summary, increases collagen density, elasticity, moisture, youth appearance, proprietary blend and citrus blend. We need, again, we need that young pumpkin fruit, which is a kind of a citrus. 
I think it's a bitter citrus, bitter orange, because all this thing is synergistically promoting collagen elastic production. Look at this, provides supply of vitamin C and antioxidants, red ruby, uh, ruby quinoa extra unlocks the cell's ability to absorb collagen as it activates natural collagen synthesis. Now, the flavor is an apple berry composition, which is what you see on the slide. Apple, cranberry, raspberry, strawberry, no added sugars or artificial sweeteners. Now, now we're getting to the meat of the matter. So this is the benefits and results of some clinical trials that were done on the ingredients of the liquid collagen. It reduces the appearance of fine lines and wrinkles. It improves the skin moisture, tone, and texture. It helps to protect against the damaging effects of oxidative stress. It prevents collagen breakdown and improves skin elasticity. It supports healthy, youthful looking hair and nails. It increases collagen density by 42%. It reduces the crow's feet, aging, hello, reduces skin roughness. Well, 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 well. It increases the superoxide dismutase by 27 times. I'm just wondering how, probably through NRF2 activation and other stuff. Ding, 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 ding. Life Vantage, it increases blood catalase. Ding, 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 ding. NRF2, SOD, catalase. Increases the skin elasticity. And these are results from eight weeks clinical trial that was done by, people, uh, by um, uh, uh, companies that uh, help with, the, with our proprietary blend. Now, I really wanted to show you one picture, seven days. And that's about it, people. Thank you very much. If you have any questions, I can try to answer them. I love, I love, I love this. And again, you guys, most collagens on the market are about supplementing. It's not about activating and maintaining what's there. And that's really what's separating us from what I'm, I'm hearing Steta say, you know, and having all of the different collagen types that we do is also important. So, you know, you're going to get the benefits of reducing fine lines and wrinkles, increasing elasticity of the skin and all of that. But you get the inside body benefits of increasing these things that we already know are so powerful when you unlock the body's pharmacy, things like catalase and SOD. So I am so, well, I am just absolutely honored anytime we get blessed with your knowledge because I'm just a finance guy. Um, and I love to hear the science from uh, a medical professional like yourself. I know you dig into the research over and over and over being a, a partner with our company on the scientific advisory board. It's something you take very, very serious because your name is behind what we're represented representing. So we, we love you, Dr. Sveta. Thank you for blessing everybody here. And I cannot wait to hear more from you down the road. Thanks for watching. And remember, one change can have an enormous effect. Remember to subscribe, hit the bell and the like, and we'll see you next time on Love to Live.